Gentlemen, you know the rules. Obey my commands at all times. Protect yourselves at all times. If you want to now, touch gloves. Step back. Okay, guys, start in one minute. Good luck. Referee Lance Vanola. There we go. Where did it go? Doctors here. EMTs ready. You ready, sir? You ready, sir? Fox. One. Munoz coming out in the southpaw stance. I like seeing a good southpaw versus an orthodox fighter. Yes. Very tough fight between a southpaw and an orthodox fighter due to the fact that they are fighting for space. Lowry's first fight, but it doesn't seem intimidated. He was swinging a little bit. I saw that left and right come in. Nothing really landed so far, but I like his confidence. Hands are up. Absolutely, Scott. He seems to be relying on the jab, stepping into his punches. It's actually very good for his first day here. The body shot by Munoz. Fainted up top, went downstairs with a jab. Uh -oh. Lowry says no, but usually that means yes when you see a fighter say no. Absolutely. That was a very good counter punch by him. Munoz I mean, using his feet as defense. Really, really something to see. He's getting his space beautifully, just stepping right outside of range when Lowry comes in with a jab or a straight right. Lowry hits his gloves together as if to say, come on, let's let's fight. Good body shot and right hook upstairs by Munoz. Good double jab by Munoz. Comes over the top with the left. Here's a be confusing Lowry a little bit there with this in and out movement. Yeah, great point. The punches are coming up short when he goes to take it. Credit to Munoz's footwork. I mean, he, he knows his range. He gets inside to hit, and when Lowry goes to hit back, he's just an inch or two short. Yes. Beautiful pull counter by Munoz. Slip back a little bit, straight left hand, right down the middle. I like to look at the feet when it's a, it's a southpaw and, a, and an orthodox fighter. Beautiful left hand. Munoz lands a 1-2-3 as well. Now a 1-2. Again, a credit to his footwork. He's in, he hits, and then he's out of range, and then he gets back into range to throw another combo. Yes. Lowry's looking very confused at the how to land a clean shot on Munoz. And again, that's a credit to his footwork. In and out movement. Yes. Understand where to be. It's just like you said, Scott, you know, watching the footwork, but if you notice, yes, Danger is moving to the outside. He's making sure that his foot stands outside of, of Lowry's. He's looking to the body, comes upstairs. That's a veteran move. I like the way Munoz is actually looking down at the body of Lowry, and then he comes up top of the hook. Making Lowry seconds. think he's going to the gut, but then he comes over the top. Veteran move. Must have a must have a great trainer. Credit to Tony Burgess. Time! And you know I got Munoz standing up still. Looks relaxed. Let's look at the replay. Straight left hand. He walks away, just like a home run hitter. Just hit a nice home run and then walks off. Yeah. Comes right back into range with the one, two, three. That footwork and that full sequence was, was fantastic. In range, lands a one, two, three, out of range for the counter. Back in range for another one, two. Munoz just understands where he needs to be at all times. It, it's, it's amazing to see. And credit to Lauer. He, he tried to make it a little rough at the end of that first round. Here he is again, throwing four or five punches. Munoz with the one, two. It's three to the butt. Yeah. And you can see those elbows come in from Lowry. He must have felt a body shot. Don't be surprised to see Munoz go back downstairs and right back up top soon. Stop! Break clean. Back up. Back up. Box. Hands are still up. Talk about Lowry. Elbows are still in. Maybe still feeling the effect of that body shot. Another beautiful straight left hand to the body from Munoz. He smells blood in the water, and he's letting his hands go. Beautiful left and right to the body. I would expect him to come back up top very soon and see if he can land something big. Now those hands are coming down, those elbows are coming down from Lowry, but I guess we'll see. There's a beautiful straight left hand up top. 
filing it on. There's no response from Lowry. There's a right hand that misses. But the combinations are definitely finding their target. Yeah. He's landing them every time he throws a punch. Munoz landing an uppercut straight Beautiful. left to the head. I wouldn't be surprised Beautiful. to see the ref step in very soon. There's a lot of unanswered punches, and that's a big deal to referees, especially a veteran like Wayne Spinoza. More right hook, left hand up, right hand to the body. With still a minute and a half left to go in this round. Break clean. And Munoz is piling Break clean. on the pressure. You all right, dude? You want to keep going? Here we go. Box. He even asked him if he wanted to keep going. You can see it's getting a little bit much to let this go on. There's a feint to the body and a straight left up top by Munoz. Doubled it. Credit to his body work. Lowry has no idea if the punches are coming up top or downstairs. One, two. And another two by Munoz. And another one, two. And a right hook. There's not any response by Lowry. I would expect the ref to stop it very soon. Head and body by Munoz. Straight left up top again. And the punches just look hard. You can tell by the way that he's snapping Lowry's head back. You can hear ref take here, the Punches are definitely solid. Power behind each punch. Left up and one. Damn. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. We could have done that. Notice that the ref stepped in. He didn't quit. Let's see if we can watch a replay here. Beautiful straight left by Munoz. Slipping, moving back. Left uppercut. That's what it was. More of like an up cross kind of sequence. Right hook, straight left. You know what? The ref, I think, stopped it. The reactions are bad from Lowry. He was taking them straight down the middle. His head was snapping back, and there wasn't a lot of response. Got to stop it. Yeah, it's too many blows. When, when there's no response, absolutely. You don't want the fighter to get hurt. So yeah. You definitely want to step in and stop the fight. At two minutes and 30 seconds in round two. Your winner by TKO in the red corner, Angel Machete Munoz!